Let's see how good we are with one-handed ventilation with the seal on the mask here. So you can see we're getting ventilation, a volume of about 273, 300. So, you know, low 300s, high 200s is kind of what we're looking at for volume. So a little bit under ventilated when we're using one hand. And the peep valve isn't working nearly as well because we're breaking seal. We have some leakage. Let's try a two-handed ventilation, two-handed on the mask to make that seal. And look at the volumes. We're getting over 400 in some cases, 391. So we're basically getting in the range of 100 more mils per breath. Plus, you can notice that the, the peep valve is, is holding the volume or holding the pressure a little bit better as well because we're not breaking seal. We don't have leakage in between ventilation. So from a peep perspective, a pressure perspective that we want to maintain, as well as a volume perspective, it's clear that the two-handed ventilations is a much better technique than the one-handed ventilation. Do you love our short videos and you're worried that you're going to miss some of them? Well, don't worry about that because we're going to send them straight to your email. All you need to do is hit the link in the bio and we're going to send all of our daily videos straight to your email so you can get your daily dose of medicine. Hit the link in our bio and sign up right now.